Hello guys, it's Riker. Welcome back to another video, man. Today we're going to be talking about the 2019 uh, Kanka Cup, Gold Cup, aka the uh, 2019 Copa Hora. Uh, this is the North American Central, North American Central Caribbean um, e uh, Continental Tournament. Uh, this is going to be a lot of tournament this year. We already got an Asian Cup that took place last uh, in January of this year. And then the Copa Hora, the Kanka Cup Gold Cup taking place this summer. We got the Copa America taking place this summer and the Cup of Nation, I mean uh, African Cup of Nation this summer also. And uh, we're going to have the 2020 um, Euro Cup that's next year. The qualification are going on right now, man. But I'm very excited for this tournament for the first time ever in the tournament history. It's going to be, um, it's going to be 16 team in general, man. It should be very interested. Um, Jamaica went to the final for the last two years in a row. Two times in a row in the last uh, previous two uh, uh, of Gold Cup. They lost both games by like, what, 2-1? The first one, like 3-0 or 3-1 versus Mexico. And uh, this, the last time was versus USA, 2-1. Man. So, US and um, Mexico are the dominant force when it comes to this, man. They always win it, man. Uh, it's either US or Mexico win it. But um, hopefully this year we see a different winner. But never know, man. Mexico looking very good right now. US looking very good. And I don't see anybody really competing with those guys uh, right now. Um, Canada looked very well last year, man, with this guy. What's his name? Uh, Alfonso Davis was one of the top goal scorers. He was like 16 years old um, in 2017, man, being one of the top goal scorers in the tournament. So it should be a very interesting tournament overall, man. Looking forward to it. Hopefully, I could do a lot of coverage on it and uh, a lot of live stream and uh, post-match analysis and everything preview all that stuff so hopefully i could do a lot of stuff on it because it's gonna be so much going on man so it's gonna be very hard to cover all these games and keep up with all these gaming but uh we i'm going to talk about the the, the list of the uh, nation that's going to take place in it uh we got bermuda we got canada um costa rica cuba caraco el salvador um guyana haiti um honduras uh jamaica martinique martinique uh, Mexico, Nicaragua, Panama, Trinidad and Tobago, and USA, man. So it's going to be a very, very good tournament. Um, Mexico went to the last World Cup. Same with um, Panama. Who else? Mexico, Panama. And I'm missing two other countries from Kanga region. But yeah, the Mexico and Panama is the only one that I could remember that went to the World Cup uh, in 2018. But yeah, man, this should be a very in Costa Rica. Yeah, Costa Rica went too. Um, this one should be a very interesting tournament, uh, and uh, looking forward to see how it turns out. Um, we see Guyana in the tournament for the. This is the first time I'm seeing him in the tournament. Same with Bermuda. Um, it should be very interesting to see how those guys do it. Uh, but yeah, as I said, man, U.S. and Mexico is the favorite. Um, I'm not sure who are the seeded country. I want to say um, Canada, Honduras, Mexico, and U.S. Those are the seeded country. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, man, it should be a very interesting tournament. Looking forward to it. Let me know what team you're supporting, man. What country you're representing. Me, man, I'm supporting U.S. and, and Jamaica because those are my nationality. Um, I was born in Jamaica, but I grew up in U.S., so those are the team I'll be supporting. Uh, Mexico, probably the third team. Uh, but yeah, it should be very interesting, man. I want to see my Caribbean teams do very well. I want to see how the Central American teams does it, and the North American teams are going to be very good. I think Canada Canada going to be even better now because they have Alphonse Davis, um, who played for Bayern Munich right now. Man, last time he was in the, um, he was one of the top goal scorer in the tournament. He was 16 years old, playing for um, uh, Vancouver Whitecaps in MLS. Man, he was fantastic, and uh, I think he's going to be even better right now, man. So Canada probably one of the uh, dark horse of this tournament, but it should be a very interesting tournament. I want to see how Jamaica is going to do again, if they're going to be able to get to the final for the third time in a row and break the voodoo of winning it, man. But it should be a very interesting tournament. As I said, man, represent in the comments section, man. Let me know anything about the tournament. Let me know if you're looking forward to it. And uh, what tournament are you going to be watching this summer, man? Um, you're going to watch the uh, Kenka Cup Champion League, Copa Hora. Sorry, Kenka Cup uh, Gold Cup, Copa Hora, or the Copa America. Or the um, African Cup of Nation, man. Let me know what you think about everything, man. But with that, subscribe. And with that, you boys out of here. Peace.